This your boy came out a holiday. Like Soldier Boy once said. He said, SOD, SOD, Ocean Gang. Oh God. Ocean Gang a drum. Now, it seems that the people in that submarine were not Ocean Gang. Because before we get into the topic, man, first off, let me, you know, send my thoughts and prayers to the families. And this ain't just some disclaimer stuff. But we gonna, I recommend that the families don't watch this right away. Because it's not easy. See, the story, pretty sure you already know the story. If you don't, I'm going to tell you briefly. So the submarine, let me put it like this. A group of people who paid 250000 um, you know, as they said, this is this what, this what they said. Go make sure yourself, because I don't spread mis or disinformation. I'll drop a diss on, but not no disinfo. Make it a habit. If I told you the sky is blue, go make sure. Boom. They pay two fifty thousand each to be a part of the submarine, and they told them whoever the CEO or founder of the company told them that hey, we gonna go underwater. We gonna go deep, real deep, deeper than. Yo, mama go. <laughs> Holy. No, you miss me. It's been a while. What up, hi? Shout out Hassan Campbell. Anyway, so they go underwater and they don't come back. The whole thing. Now listen, bro. The CEO, founder, whoever. I got to give it to him. You know, first off, they said that, um, this is detail, they said that um, um, it, <laughs> it was piloted by what resembles a PlayStation controller. Ale. Now, I'm going to speak to the people with the jokes, but first off, let me, let me talk about some. Bro. And this is why I told the family, don't watch this right away. Give it some time. But I got to say this because we got to learn from it. If you got 250000 to throw away, that's a quarter million. Quarter million dollars. Some of your favorite rappers don't even sign for two fifty. Most of the people on your Instagram feed Flexing the Lambos and like, I don't have to fit. They don't have a half ten, a hundred. It's a lot of money. All right. The unemployment boy is talking about 100K. Is it, what's it? 100K is the new 10K. Yeah, nigga. It's a lot of money either way. Especially in, in this day and age of the economy. Why do you think it's so much hate haters? It's a different video for them. Listen, you got 250 to blow just like that. Just to throw away. What's the new monetization? Can I curse? Screw the Titanic. Nigga, fuck that Titanic. 250000 I can go to... If you got that type of money, go to Dubai. Unless you're on Interpol, Most Wanted or something. Go to Dubai. Okay? Travel. Go to the mall in Dubai. Not Dubai Mall. I think it's Jumeirah Mall. The one that looks like a Disney palace. I think they built it to look like that. 
You know the one. If you reach Dubai app, they'll tell you. In the entrance, look to your left. If they haven't changed, there's an advertisement for skydiving. According to YouTube regulation, right? This is in accordance with the regulation. So I don't promote dangerous behavior. But I'm going to tell you what's going on out there. Reality is. If you got $250, I swear to God, I'm not making this up. Wow. It's a coincidence that it's $250. 250 United States dollars. USD. They take you on a trip. You get on a plane. You jump off a plane, skydive. It's done correctly, in accordance with with the with the with the country's um whoever is regulator of safety is. And you jump off a plane. If you're scared, you're like, man, my parachute might not go off. What if I get stuck? Don't worry. A professional will jump with you and you're tied to him. So you still get to skydive and dude is behind you professional. You jump out of planes all day. $250. $250. The rest of the money, so take 250 USD. You can jump out of a plane. Perfect. And don't worry. My bro said, you got to eat before. I told him, don't worry. That They got a whole company of, they're going to show you what to eat, how to do it. They got training videos. The professional is going to be with you. They even got a guy to jump out the plane with you. He's a cameraman. Shout out YSM Woody. <laughs> They got, he jump out with a parachute and a camera and he'll film you. Uh, $250. These guys pay $250. Not dollars, $250. $1,000. Just to go in and never. If I had $250 to throw like that. I'm doing the, what I told you to describe Dubai. Finish du in Dubai, you can do a lot more than skydive. You can. I forget what it's called. It's like floating in the air. Ooh, you can do a lot. You go snow. You know how you do snow skating? In Dubai's desert inside a mall. You can do a lot. Just Dubai. Budget. <sighs> Balling. 10K. And Dubai is not expensive, especially if you carry dollar. You leave Dubai, you go to Thailand. You go to Saudi Arabia. Now they change. They're no longer head chopping. They're uh, tourist attracting. <laughs> MVS, what up? You leave Saudi. You go to... We said Thailand. India. Bucket list. I always wanted to visit India. I don't recommend. But if you want to go check out. you want to Remember how Andrew Tate's channel used to have like crazy stories. In the hood. When I go see. He likes to see dangerous. And hardcore situations. As they are. Not no tourist. Uh, hotel to resort type of thing. So I don't recommend this part. And I wouldn't, I, I'm consider this a joke. I wouldn't do it. But I might go to Afghanistan because it's next, next to India. And look at those, you know, just to see what the, what the, what the hype's about. And then, so, we, so far we got India, Afghanistan. I'm not going to Pakistan. I don't like it. I love people, but it's the purge. Man, I might go to Israel just to see what if it's if it's cap, you know. 
I'm taking Ben with me, my Jewish friend. What up? Because I need him. He'll be my, you know. <laughs> anyway. Then you can go to Africa. Go over there. I'm going to all the African places that is not active war zone. And we're going to make a final stop at South Africa where the white people is at. Then you finish Africa. You finish it. You can go the whole world with 250,000. This whole planet. You get tired. Instead of all, if you can explore the whole planet and still have money left. But you didn't do that. You gave 250000 to one guy that no one heard of before. If you gave it to Elon Musk to go to space or go underwater and whatever happened, happened, at least I'd be like, hey. And it was Elon, I get it. Who is this guy you give? Who the fuck is that? I can go register a company today and come tomorrow and tell you I can take you underwater. Yeah, right. Hale. He was better off. Like, I'm I'm doing you know documentaries coming soon, hush puppy, African scammers. It's similar to it. Like you just open up a company, come back tomorrow. Let's go to Titanic. Really, nigga? Nah. You was better off doing fraud. <laughs> You had better off scamming him. At least then they'd be alive. But he thought he got it under control. He thought that he really going to take him and come back up. Who built the submarine? Who approved it? Was it even approved by anybody? At least the alcohol and tobacco people. This thing happened where I live, bro. And people here are nice, so I can see that happening. But two fifty thousand, you give it to one dude. With a submarine. They might have assumed that, you know, hey, I mean it is twenty twenty three. And even Iran <laughs> Say they got a submarine, so you probably good. Nah, bro. He got a submarine off wish.com. No, this is just jokes. Don't sue me. He got a submarine off of Alibaba. <laughs> Don't sue me, please. It's just jokes. When I was younger, I visited Egypt, a place called Shalom. Shalom Sheikh. It sounds scary, but it's it's really chill. It's resorts and stuff. They take you on a boat that has like a transparent bottom part so you can see the fish. I was young, but there was the option to go underwater. Just like the skydiving professional. Uh, uh, the regulate. The regulatory approvals and stuff, Egypt, you know, has corruption. I don't really trust it, but nobody died. So it's Gucci. And they got a little mini submarine. But here's the thing. Their submarine, how I seen it, it had a rope. Like, <laughs> my boy said a rope. I told him not a rope. The fish can eat the rope. Had a chain, like a metal chain. Chains, uh, multiple. Wrapped around like a, 
like a wire almost. With this hard coated material. So that it don't rust, don't break. And it's tied to the submarine, uh, submachine, submarine. And it's tied to the submarine. So when they go underwater, in the case that the controller battery ran out, <laughs> ooh, you can be like, bing, bing, Elbert, pull me back up. How did this guy not have it? How did you hop in the submarine? There's no main ship on above water? Did you swim to it? 250K, not even that? Two fifty thousand, not even a main ship. How did they know you was missing? Who organized this? Psh, told you. Now I don't recommend scamming YouTube team. It's not his behavior. But hypothetically here speaking, wouldn't it? <laughs> If you scammed them, they'd be alive and you'd be up to 50,000 for them. Like, at least then you'd have to. For everyone. Uh, and some of them were my bros. And I gave them good advice, they listened. Some people uh, respect my advice. I'd love to give it. And they're good people. They're just misguided. But some people are just stupid like that. Now, if you were one of the people... Mocking the, 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 how they passed away. Or trying to say, like, I'm trying to watch my mouth, but listen. And it, <sighs> trying to say, like, who cares if they pass away? This is some rich people. Hmm? I hope that everyone who said such a, you know, who said, F their life, basically, because they're rich. Or that it don't matter that they're gone because they're rich. I really do hope that all of you get so rich. And I hope all of you get rich as F. Not just rich. I hope, may God, make it rain abundance on you. And hopefully you never have to worry for money ever again. Say amen. When you do get rich, I want you to remember the stuff you were saying now. The F rich people. The goal should be try to get rich. Especially for men. I don't know about girls. Girls already beat you to it. Everybody now <laughs> got the got them an OF paid. I met some girls that, you know, trying to be like, No, I'm a good girl. I don't have an OF. I got a private snap. Oh, so it's the thing. Do I blame the girls? Are we going towards a devilish society? No, bro. Economy's bad. Pay attention to the next video. I got a lot of politics to talk about. Oh, yeah. Don't talk about that. Nah, talk about it. You sitting in your house? A country like Sudan or whatever, trying to trying to mind your business, trying to be a family, <laughs> and a missile come hit you. In these parts of the world, not caring about politics is not an option. It's a luxury. If you take the rights you got for granted, you lose them. Just don't cry about it when you do. Hit like, smash subscribe, be human. Rich people are human too. Your mentality should be to want to get rich, to strive to get rich, not be broke and say F everyone who's rich. Hmm? <laughs> yeah.
I'm not trying to join your pity party. Even when I was broke, I don't have 250 to play with. But when I had nothing, nothing, it seemed so unsuccessful. I didn't say F you because you're successful. I said, can't wait till it's my turn. <laughs>